Alright guys, welcome back to Sniper Elite 3. We are heading into the actual canyon base where they're building the tank right now. So we left them General Vaughan upstairs with an explosion to the ammo crate for the tank. So what's the objective right. there? Time to take this piece down. Okay, so we're going to put charges on the pillars. There's four pillars. Where's the objective gone? Give me the objective. Touchpad. There we go. Okay, so... There's going to be a crap ton of enemies in here. You'd suspect. The first one's 40 meters away. Let's get the pistol out. I don't think we want to be sniping too much in here. It looks quite close quarters. So we got a guy there. Probably going to go around clockwise on these pillars. Yeah, they're all in like the corners. So that's just the... Um oh, hello. <laughs> that guy's going in there now. Let's try and get past them as quick as we can. Oh shit, that guy's walking towards us. I thought he was walking away. Okay, this guy on the left. I don't know how far he's going to go. We've also got a guy right there now. Let's hope he walks past and doesn't come... Oh shit, he stopped. Okay, we've cl killed him. He's no longer a problem. He didn't actually alert anyone. Someone may find his body though. This guy stopped. He's probably going to turn around again now. Yeah, they found his body. That's fine. And let's take this guy out. Just so we got less enemies, you know, to worry about. Now we've got another guy around this corner. Fuck. We're going to wait for him to come around and we might shoot him in the head. You'd think if they um, found dead bodies where they're building the tank, they'd set the alarm off, you know? Do a full shutdown and, like, do a full inspection. But he just finds the body and goes, oh, yeah, yeah. People, this is a war. People die all the time. Okay, here comes this guy. Let's shoot him in the head as he walks around. Okay, he spotted me immediately there. So that's, um, we still could took him out, though. No problem. Okay, we're putting a charge on this pillar. Okay. Here's the first charge. We've got a sound masking thing there. We're not going to use that just yet because I don't think we need to. We're just going to stealth our way through to um, the objectives. Okay, I'm probably going to go up the top of this catwalk, actually. Cat catwalk, excuse me. And we'll um, avoid. Actually, no, it's down there, isn't it? And there's no one here anyway, so we can probably just walk through. There's another sound masking game thing we can sabotage there. Generator. There's not as many guy you know, soldiers I was as as I, as, I, uh, as I was expecting. Oh god, there's one right there. Get behind these boxes. Okay, reset, and I will walk back behind the boxes. Okay, let's try and get behind. There was a gap there. We can go through. Take him out from behind. That's unfortunate. That he actually did start spotters. So we're in cover still. Let's plant this charge and make our way backwards. Okay, that guy's found his body. Leave him to it. We'll try and just get away from him. Oh shit, we need to go on this side. Okay, we can stand up here because there's no one here. I'm far enough away to make not be heard. Relocation successful. That guy like spotted me out the side of his head. Okay, I just want to come up here to get out the way. Okay, next pillar is over that side, and it looks like we can take the catwalk all the way across. So that's... Yes, nicht. Yes, nicht. Yeah. That's what I thought. Okay, so that's the pillar we just put the, the explosive on, down below. I just hear the sound, apparently. I'm not making any sound. Whoa, that's the tank. I completely just ignored that. I forgot all about the tank. What? It's huge. Looks like something of Star. Like I saw the spot me then. Looks like something of Star Wars. What? <laughs> I think that would win win the war. That would be the the, the, the deciding factor. Okay, so we're, oh, it looks like we're actually planting the explosive on this level on the catwalk. That's um. That's good. Do you smell that? What? Ah, do you smell victory? Let's see what he says about that in like another 10 minutes maybe when we've planted all the charges and blown up the tank. Let's see what he thinks about victory just then. 
Okay, so it looks like we actually planted up higher again there, so we're gonna have to go up this catwalk to the left. Um, they're looking out that way, that's fine. We may start to spot us though, as we walk in front of them. No, nope, that's fine. Alright, let's see what's up here. I'll get stuck on that lamp. There's a guy just in front of us right there. He's starting to spot us. We are in the light as well, so we need to crawl out to that light. Yeah, it's gone squintier. The eye. I think this is the last charge, actually. Yeah, that was, that was quick. Pattern three charges. So he's walking away now. We've got an open window to walk across. I would start to run, but I'm not sure if he'll hear us from there. Oh, there's a guy on the end there. Let's try and get the charge on before he makes it down this. Oh god, he's spotting us. Okay, so still, he's, when we crouch, he can't see us. Okay, so we planted all the charges. What's the next objective? Oh god, who's this? Uh, there's always an extra tank, isn't there? Okay, this guy's actually walking towards us now. What's the objective there? Um, set an explosive charge on the rat. Oh god. So I've got to get on top of it. Let's get behind the cover. Um, how am I get on top? I gotta, there's, there's a ladder there, the side of it. Um, okay, this guy here, I'm gonna see if I can get him out the way first, because there's actually a set of stairs opposite us. I'm not sure how you actually access the tank, probably from the side of it. So, when we get this guy out the way, we'll have a closer inspection. I don't think there's anyone behind us that we have to worry about. No, we don't. So, it's just this guy. Once we get this guy out the way. Okay, he's turning around. Yep, he's turned around. So we can just um, have a stab this guy and just shoot him. I'm going to shoot him just to get it over with. Yep, he's down. Okay, so it looks like we're trying to get on top of the tank. In the middle, right there. Let's search this corpse. He didn't have anything on him. Where's that tank that just opened the door? Oh, what's that? That's the tank. Um, is he sp oh, can we can't spot you, can we? Um, let's mark him up. So, if we walk up, is he going to see us if we walk down there? Let's test it. No, he's not seeing us. Can we climb on this? Yes, we can. Shit, he's spotting us there. Um, look, what's around here? <laughs> let's walk towards the camera. Okay, so we, we come on the front of it. I didn't really want to walk. Can we, can we climb it on this side? Can we climb this side? There's a ladder there. Okay. So. Um, what's this guy doing? Having a little techno rave. Got the flashing lights going. Okay, let's, let's take this guy out. Can we knife him? We may as well get the guy that's on the front of the tank as well. As long as no one's spotting us on the catwalks. Sorry to ruin your party, your dance party. Okay, there's a ladder right there. Where's the tank? Is that tank's not going to see us, is it? Not the tank, you know, the, the mounted... Oh god, this guy's on the left spotting us there. Shit. Okay, they didn't actually spot us though. So that's fine. They, they are probably going to come over and investigate, though. Right. Time to get out of here. Okay, so we set an explosive. Time to get out of here. Escape from the hangar. That's the objective. Can we um, can we drop down here? And go the way we came. <coughs> oh, fuck. Why is the alarm going off? What's that alarm mean? So, that, that tank that came in is not a problem. I think we're going to... Yeah, that's the side we started on. There's a left we came down to start. Can we, um... I'm gonna go down, down those stairs and try and escape. Stuck. What's the alarm for? They're not attacking. Maybe it's just a factory alarm to mean, like, lunch break or something. Because <laughs> there are guys walking in and out. 
Well, how many people out there? Okay, let's just mark these guys up because they're heading out there. We need to also blow the charges before we escape. And we didn't put any flint and tinder, and I don't think there's remote charges in this game. So, how are we going to blow it up? Okay, so we've marked most of them now that are um, near the outside escape door. We can run around here up a little bit because um, there's no one here. I have to go crouch, crouch stick. What? Whoa! They shoot the tank. That's what the alarm's for. To alert everyone that they're going to be blowing shit up. What are they shooting at? There's, there, there are men are right there in front of it. I can't escape through this, can I? I don't think I can. That's not the objective anyway. Oh fuck. Before I marked all these guys. Fuck, these guys walking over here now. That guy's not marked as well, on the left. Could do it marking him, just to know where he is. And now it's unmarked him. You can only have a set amount of people marked at a time. Let's hope he doesn't spot us out the side of his eye. Okay, he's walking up more that way now. And this, guy, this guy's walking away as well. There's two guys in the actual door. We're going to have to take these two out with the pistol. Got nine shots, so it's plenty. Um, hey. Hey, I missed. Got him. How the hell did he not call anyone? So, I'm in cover. Escape from the hangar. There's the objective up there. They've spotted bodies, it looks like. Take the shot and detonate the charge. Okay, so I need to take the shot. How do I get past these guys, though? Can I climb this? I can't climb that. I need to take these guys out. Can I distract them with um, stuff? Okay, so I'm quite clear behind me. Maybe if I head towards the gate and crawl to the other side, I may be able to, may, may be able to get around them. It's going to be a long crawl. All clear. Let me just check if I, if I stand up, will you see me? They're actually they're too far away to actually even see me. There's a mounted gun there aimed at them. Okay, we're not getting spotted. We're fine. We are sneaking around. That's cool. In cover. What does that mean? No one's spotted me, have they? See, I can actually sneak past all these guys. The only guy that can risk of seeing me there is um, the guy on the farthest side. Because the guy on the right is behind the box. So let's see if we can sneak around. Yep, we got past them. It might be worth taking out some of these guys now. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm just going to go past, go past them all. <laughs> there's, there's a guy up here, though, on the map. Yeah. Let's hope he stays there. Doesn't turn around. We'll have to take this guy out. Okay, here's a sniper nest we're going to use to um, shoot the charge on the tank. Until we put it in a position where I can actually see it from here. <laughs> uh, so we are full on a lot of things. To enter the sniper nest. We haven't got any masking sounds. But I think this might be the last shot in the game. If it's the shot to destroy the... Um, what am I doing? I'm shooting that. Okay, let's do this. That's gonna fall and explode because they're shells themselves. They probably might explode and impact. And okay, let's just see what happens. Let's just shoot this. Boom! Oh, there's a shot. The last shot. Ah. Ooh! <laughs> it's raining. Oh shit. It blown up instantly. Valen's pissed. Can I get do I get to shoot Valen as well? Is he gonna escape?
We are the same. You and I. Help me! I am nothing like you. I remember who I killed. So it's not going to be a sniper shot. Ooh. Perfect shot. Right between the eyes. I'm surprised that it wasn't a sniper shot to kill the main bad guy. Dead, and the rat is destroyed. But the war is far from over. There are plenty of targets worthy of a bullet. Men who need to die. Time to find more work. Alright, that's the end of Sniper Elite 3. So, um, thanks for watching, guys. Um, it, I quite enjoyed the game. It was a short game. Only like eight missions. But um, the it's similar to the previous Sniper games in the way that, you know, it's called Sniper, but a lot of it is about stealth and not a lot of it is what a sniper should be doing, which is being way back at the back of the fight and sh taking shots without being even people know when you're on the battlefield. You know, a lot of this was um, sneaking around inside close quarters. The odd sniper shot was available with the, some masking sounds. But other than that, you know, the, the sniper mechanics are really good. But, you know, the, the mechanics of the game and the way it's meant to be played, if you're going for a stealth playthrough, is, is it's not a sniper game. So um, with that, I'm going to end that here, guys. Um, thanks for watching. Please do subscribe, and I'll let you guys watch the rest of the credits. See ya. Made more urgent by the discovery of Project Zoika, and to ensure that no similar plans could ever come to fruition, British and American air forces undertook a five-month campaign of strategic bombing in an effort to cripple German steel production and hasten the end of the war. It became known as the Battle of the Ruhr, reaching an intrepid height in May 1943 with Operation Chastise.
Oh look, this is the um, the summary of the mission. See how I got on. Wonder what the maximum rank is as well. I think the ranks are probably separate to their multiplayer. So there was advanced weapon plans I didn't collect. I killed 35 enemies. Enemies tagged 51. Relocations 5. Uh, pretty happy with that. Um, outcome? You saved the day. That was the mission. Just the day. Didn't save the world. Didn't save America. So, you know, just the day.